secrets to standing out everywhere you go or anywhere you go. Right, first thing you need to understand, disclaimer, like the video, subscribe to the YouTube channel if you are new. So don't miss anything, dropping on the Wise to Method YouTube channel. It takes one second, bro, support your boy. Appreciate the views, but we need to engage. Get me up this mountain. Drop an emoji, it takes one second. All right, sweet. Now, if you're the type of Donny that wants to stand out, talk this way, walk this way, my question to you would be, you need to understand if you care so much about what others think about you, bro, then you've already lost and you will never really stand up. Why? Because your brain will self-sabotage because by default, bro, you're lowering your value to the point where you're seeking external validation in order to make yourself feel happy, bro. If you care so much about what other people think about you and you want everybody to like you, bro, you're never going to really stand out, bro. Never walk and talk and be like everybody else. Remember, all you can do is be you, bro. Remember, you can only be you because everybody else is already taken. That's it, bro. If you're afraid of neg negativity, if you're afraid of judgment, bro, your brain will just play mind games on itself, bro. You don't need external validation. You need to love the guy you see in the mirror to the point that you just don't care about anything anybody says, bro. You have to be so cold with it. Heartless, bro. Bro, anyway, to the point why you're here, bro. Two things. The first thing you need to do is you need to capture what we call scarcity in order to stand out. Stay with me, bro. Let me give you an example, bro. You're in a nightclub, bro. There are 10 girls there. They're all wearing black dresses, except for one of them. She's wearing red. Naturally, your brain's going to process that girl as the scarce one, right? Because she stands out because she's in red. Listen up. The second way that you're going to instantly stand out, bro, is when you're talking to that girl and you can pay her a compliment that's going to make her flustered or just almost break her pattern, bro, to the point where she's going to remember you. I'm going to give you an example, bro. bro and obviously, you know she's feeding you, but she's maybe she's playing hard to get, bro. She, she's going to be talk to you about her, her day at work or something random, bro. Just pause and say, look, hey, listen, I just have to say, look, you got some nice lips, you know. Pause. Bro, her brain's going to be scrambled. The key is, bro, your job is to stay in her mind, right? And when we talk about lips, what do we think about? Kissing. So she's going to be thinking about kissing you based on the assumption that she finds you attractive, based on the assumption that you've already demonstrated higher value the whole way through that conversation. Back and forth, back and forth. You know she wants you, bro. You know the guts are getting watery. You know she wants dick in mouth. See you in the next one, boys. Keep learning, keep going, keep living up. Peace.